Muslims should not concede or compromise with people when we have the higher ground or we have the upper ground. Uh, and there's actually an amazing ayah in the Quran, uh, ayah 139 in Surah Al-Imran. Uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he says, وَلَا تَهِنُوا وَلَا تَحْسَنُوا وَأَنْتُمُ الْأَعْلَوْنَ إِنْ كُنْتُمْ مُؤْمِنِينَ And the specific context of this ayah is in the context of warfare, but Allah words this ayah generally enough to apply to more than just warfare. It's that don't don't be weak. Don't be weak and don't be sad when you have the upper hand. If you are believers or if you're people who believe, right? So we see this all the time when it comes to interfaith stuff, right? It's like Islam, we're not like other religions out there because uh, we're not a quote unquote, just another religion. We are the, we have the truth, right? Islam is the truth. The Quran are the actual words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It's preserved from how it was sent. We have the, we know more about our prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa than anybody knows about their prophets, right? And it's been uh, authenticated and attested and, you know, all this sort of thing. And then somebody comes and their, their, their tradition has been less preserved and they've had problems. They've lost the original book and, you know, they've, they've had problems, you know, maybe even, uh, uh, they don't have, for example, the Christianity, they don't really have legal, very much law to speak of. They don't have guidance when it comes to legal issues uh, and various things like this. And then from that position, they want to come to us and tell us, oh, well, we're all the same or we're all equal or we're just as valid as, as you guys. The Muslims can't bite on that and say, like, you know, we can respect each other. Like, we can treat each other like we're going to treat you fairly and we're going to, you know, honor you because you're a human being and you're, you know, Ahl Kitab, you're people who adhere to some sort of revelation, you believe in God, right? But don't tell me that you're the same as me. And don't tell me that Christianity is the same as Islam and that we just erase all the differences between us. No, 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 there's differences. There's differences. And those are, there are differences in process. There's differences in substance. And uh, to be honest with you, Islam has the upper hand. Right? We're not going to give you that concession and play this sort of thing like, oh, yeah, well, there's multiple truths and we're not really sure. And, you know, like, well, we just throw up our hands. And again, we can respect you and we can honor you and give you your due rights while realizing that we have the truth, that Islam is the truth, the Quran is the truth, the Sunnah is the truth, and the other faith traditions don't really have a lot to stand on.